So I'm doing post-operative rounds for a lady in whom we had operated her for multi-compartment endometriosis. Now, this lady had come to us with PCN, that is post-cutaneous nephrostomy, because she had a large parametrial nodule. This nodule was on both the sides, right side and left side. So what we have done is a bilateral urethric reimplantation. Along with that, we have done sigmoid resection anastomosis. We have done rectal resection anastomosis. So it is a massive surgery. But we have protected her uterus. So she is going to become pregnant after six months from now. This is what is important for you to understand on the first post-operative day. Within 24 hours, the lady is sitting and that is very good. She is ambulant on her own. That is another good thing. And these two pipes are going to change your life. One is the urine pipe because bilateral urethric implantation has been done. It is important for me to see if the urine is clear or not. It is clear. God is very kind to the patient. Urine catheter will have to be maintained for approximately three weeks. And stent we will keep for approximately six weeks. This is the drain pipe. If you see, the drain is less than 100 ml. This was emptied out today morning where it was 30 ml. First post-operative day, I can expect around 200 cc in the drain. After that, it will steadily go down. And when the drain is less than 50 ml, we will remove the drain within 10 days following the procedure. The girl will go back to her hometown after four days of such a supramajor surgery. She needs to walk. She needs to pass platus. And only then we will discharge her. 